This is my new bike I bought off of Craigslist. It's a Cannondale R300 made in the USA. The year is the year was um, of the bike 2000. Um, they don't make them anymore in USA, so they discontinued these. But um, yeah, I got a great deal. I paid uh, 300, and brand new. This bike goes for 860. $860. Um, people sell them for 500 used. I got it for three. So I think it's a great bike. It rides great. I mean, it's fast as hell. You know, being that I'm 220 pounds, six foot one, you know, it's pretty sturdy. Um, I don't feel that much road vibrations either. I don't, you know, it's a pretty smooth ride. You know, people complain about. You know how bumpy the ride is but i think it's i think it's great i mean i only rode it once but it feels really good so so here it is this is it cannondale r300 there it is Made in the USA, baby. Yeah, everything's pretty decent on this bike. Tires. They're 23. They're 700 by 23 millimeters. So, I'm going to put myself a little Cannondale bike bag, a rear bag. Put my stuff in here. Um, let's see here. Okay, here are the components. I don't know if you can see it. Tiagra rear derailleur. I have a Shimano cassette, eight speed. Um, Shimano Sora crank set and front derailleur. And I just put these pedals on because the pedals that came with it sucked. I couldn't even ride the bike. So I bought, I bought these Welgo pedals. They cost me 25 bucks plus tax. They're pretty decent, you know. Um, okay, here's the handlebars. Now... These are how you're gonna shift gears when you ride this bike. The brake. You, you know, you brake with the same thing and then you move to the side to, to change the gear you're in. Same thing with this one. This is for the front derailleur. Uh, put a little bell on here. I'll probably change that. Maybe get a get a um, newer one. So people hear you when you come up behind them. I put this cat eye rear tail light, which is awesome, and two bottle cage holders. I mounted on here, so you know the wheels are quick release. Um, the color of this bike is just fucking amazing. You know, the finish, the, the way it was built, the frame geometry, you know, um, the welds. Everything about this bike, to me, is a number 10. A one Out of a 1 to 10, I, I give it a 10. I absolutely give this bike a 10. It's 100% for me. This, this, this is so good. So, that's it, man. There you have it. And there's my little review on my new Cannondale R300 road bike so you know I'll come back and put another review up once I put a little more mileage on this bike alright there you have it Cannondale R300